Welcome back. We're not done with the beach stuff just yet. We've got the SSS Summer Splash to go through. It's a piece of DLC, by the way. One day at the Michelin Resort's Lakeside Beach. Thanks again for inviting us out here. It's been ages since all of us last got together and came to the beach as a group. Don't mention it. You all have been looking out for Yuna's best interest for ages now. This is the least I could do for you. Consider it my way of seeing that you all get a well-earned vacation. In fact, I even arranged to have Mishi and his pals man some special attractions that I think you'll all enjoy. Wow. You didn't have to go that far. Just reserving the beach was enough. It's no trouble at all. Actually, we originally set these up when Class 7 visited the beach the other day. They enjoyed them so much that we're now trying to spin them into official attractions that our park goers can enjoy. So having you all give them a try too serves as a valuable testing run for us. Enjoy them as much as you'd like. Well, I guess we don't have much of a choice when you put it like that. But all right, we'll be sure to do that. You can count on us to put them through their paces today. Now that's what I like to hear. Thanks, Lloyd. Bye. At least we saw him this time. Class 7 didn't. They spoke about him, but he was never there. Guess who? Uh. Ah. Oh my, it's Bell Cola. Oh, it's you, Ellie. You got me good that time. I didn't even hear you coming. Sorry, sorry. I saw you standing there and couldn't help myself. Anyway, I brought you a Bell Cola. See? Today is going to be a real scorcher. So make sure to cool off. Oh, thanks. So, what were you and Matthew talking about? Would it have anything to do with why Tio and Kia can hardly contain themselves? <laughs> you could say that. Anyway, the others are probably waiting. Want to head over now? Sure. Let's go. There you are, Lloyd. You finally made it. We've been waiting for you, pal. Everything's all set up. Let the fun begin. Phew. The day only just started and I've already worked up a good sweat. Thanks for all the help, guys. Looks like we already have everything we need. Yep, I just finished inflating all the inner tubes Matthew was kind enough to leave us. Behold, Lloyd. One inner tube even has Mishy on it. So cute. So gentle. So inviting. I feel more relaxed simply by gazing upon it. You would. My favourite is the one shaped like a chocolate frosted donut. I like them both. They really do suit each other. But the real treat is Mishy, and his family coming to look after us hand and foot today. Is... Is Sight okay? He looks a bit concerned. Ah, it's like a dream come true. I couldn't possibly come up with a more perfect day if I tried. Pinch me, Lloyd. I don't want this all to just be a wonderful dream. Easy there. I promise you're not dreaming. This is as real as it gets. I'm glad everyone's so excited. It's a shame Illy and Sully couldn't join us this time. I'm sure they would have really enjoyed it. It's okay. We all know how busy their schedules have been lately. I'm just glad one of us was able to make it. Cecile was pretty bummed she couldn't take any time off either. I say we pick up some souvenirs later to let them know we're thinking of them. Oh yeah, rub it in, you know. That sounds like a great idea. Let me know when you want to do that so I can tag along. Speaking of being busy, I'm surprised I decided to tag along. I wouldn't have figured him to be a beach bum. Grr. Woof. Oh no. I think I've lost the ability to understand sight. Wait. We must be doing that because we're not alone out here. You could probably still whisper to us if you really wanted to, but yeah. Probably a good idea to keep a low profile today. That's understandable. Either way, it's good to have you with us, Zite. Oh, and Matthew is totally fine with you being here too. Feel free to roam around as much as you like. Yay, did you hear that, Zite? We can play together as much as we want. 
and we have the entire day to do whatever we want. This is officially the SSS's summer getaway. And that includes Zeit too, of course. Grr. Pretty exciting day we got ahead of us, eh, Lloyd? I guess? What are you getting at? Don't play dumb with me. I'm talking about the ladies in their swimsuits. I mean, just look at them. They were already a bunch of cuties a few years ago, but damn, it's great to refresh my memory after all this time. Randy, they're going to hear you. Dear, oh dear, Randy. Triple dot. What are you two talking about? It's a little embarrassing to be stared at so much. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to be impolite. I just wanted to say you all look great. I've known you all for so long, but I was still taken aback a little. You're all even more beautiful than you were the last time we were here together. <laughs> Thanks. L Lloyd, how does someone even respond to something like that? You just couldn't help yourself, could you? That's quite the compliment. I don't know what to say. And after three years, Lloyd still has the delicacy of a hammer to the side of the head. D do I? Lloyd, our partner and pal of mine. You know what they say, some things never change. You've always had a way of pushing the ladies' buttons without even realizing it. Seriously, it's a talent. Well, if you're determined to dig your own grave, then the least I can do is promise to be one of your pallbearers. Adios for... Bid you help me before it comes to that. Look at you two. You're just as joined at the hip as ever. Still. You're going to make me jealous, you know. Can't you spare a few glances my way for old time's sake? Personal space, Wazzy. Personal space. Do you have to stand so close? Dear, dear. Hey guys, uh, we finally made it. Oh. Oh, there they are. Who? Is it all of class 7? Nice, looks like everyone's here now. No, not everyone. Reed's here at least. Sorry we're late. The trains were a little behind schedule. We've got Tower as well. A little behind schedule. I'm glad we made it before you guys got things underway. Are we interrupting something between those two? We can come back later. Knock it off, Ash. No, just, uh, chats between a couple of friends, that's all. Damn, it's good to see you all again. Feels like it's been a hot minute since I've gotten to hang out with you kids. Hope you haven't missed me too much. We're managing. It's good to see you too. We know you've had important things to do here in Crossbell. I'm glad you're all okay and doing well. Thanks again for inviting us. We really appreciate it. Who's up there on the bench? We've never really gotten the chance for all of us to spend time together like this. This is our second beach trip recently, but everyone's been looking forward to hanging out with you guys. That's a relief. I know Michelin's not exactly the shortest trip for you to make, so thanks for coming all this way. I was worried our schedules wouldn't line up, but maybe it was just meant to be after all. I figured uni and the kiddos would make it, but it's a pleasant surprise you found the time too, Joey. Well, I have been saving up for my uh, vacation days. When Reen told me the plan, I just thought, why not? Well, of course. Of course Toe is here. I'm glad you did. We have a lot of catching up to do. It's rather exciting to return to the beach again so soon. Not only because it's a chance to bond with our crossbell friends, but... To also make more precious memories with the instructor. Oh, God. Are you sure that's not the only reason you wanted to tag along? Her motives may be questionable, but I agree with the sentiment. We should use this chance to make fond memories. Our two teams have never had a chance like this before. We should make the most of it. That's the spirit. We're here to have fun. You should all cut loose and enjoy the day for what it is. Yeah, but... Enough standing around and talking about it. Let's get this party started. I'm liking Randy's shorts there, the fire design. Agreed. What are we waiting for? 
All right, everyone, our vacation is officially underway. Woo! In this daydream, you can take in attractions by speaking with the various Mishis located along the beach. Each attraction costs one ticket to access. The characters you can invite vary at each attraction. Choose to spend your tickets wisely. You can also leave the beach and exit the daydream at any time by heading toward the Michelin Center. Furthermore, you can return to the beach via the Sporting Stone located in the Reverie Corridor. Additional tickets can be found as you explore the Reverie Corridor. Feel free to return and spend more time with characters on their day off. Will ticket. Right, so, hey! It's these guys. I want to know who's up here. Because I saw you guys during the scene. Who are you? Female guest. Totally. The air out here feels so fresh and pure too. I could stay here forever. Forever. The view from here is out of this world. Just look at all that. I mean, there's, a, there's an island. You can see the hospital. Yep. Dooby dooby doo. Alright, so let's speak to these three over here then. Everyone here looks like they're having a good time. Actually, I just discovered something. Toa and Kurt here both have an interest in Eastern culture. You don't say? It just so happens my grandfather was originally from Eastern Zemiria. Oh! Your grandfather? Okay. He's also the one who chose my name. So I always like hearing more about what it's like there. Interesting. Keep a pin in that for future. And my mother has been influenced by Eastern martial arts. Including the Eight Leaves One Blade School the instructor follows. Eastern styles tend to have a unique spirituality that fascinates me. I wouldn't mind visiting for myself one day. If I had to sum up what the East is like, in one word it would be sprawling? Starting with a visit to Long Lai may be a good idea. It's a town on the easternmost tip of the Republic, deeply ingrained in Eastern culture and customs. I think you'd have a wonderful time. Really? I heard it's almost famous for producing green tea. Oh! Now that you mention it, Angie dropped by Long Lai on her tour around the continent and told me all about it. She said the food there is also to die for. I'd love to visit someday. I lived in Calvert for a while myself, but I never got the chance to visit there. It could be fun to get the whole crew together and check it out. I'd love to show you all around if the time ever comes. It's been so long since I've relaxed at the lakeside beach like this. Last time was when we came together and you and I gave Kieran Sully swimming lessons. That takes me back. Sully still hadn't really opened up to us back then. Really? So even she went through that kind of phase. Sully had been through a lot for a girl her age. Still, she always had incredible talent deep down. She's grown so much these last few years. I couldn't be more proud of her. I don't blame you. That reminds me that we should bring her and Ilya back here again someday. I'd love that. Angie has told me all sorts of things about Long Lai. The hot springs are apparently to die for. The way she talks about them makes me want to visit someday. I wouldn't mind taking in all the traditional Eastern culture for myself. I always heard a lot about it from my late grandfather. Your late grandfather. Now we've heard things about your grandfather before, so... Hmm... I've been busy having a friendly conversation with Kurt and Toa. I never expected us to get together under conditions like this. It's a shame that Ilya and Sully couldn't join us, but there's always next time. On the topic of growth, I'm aware I can't allow myself to fall behind. I still have much to learn, both as a swordsman and as a student. I'll take the opportunity to glean what I can from Risha. Her experience makes for a wealth of knowledge. Now let's see what options we've got available at the drinks bar here this time then. <laughs> Welcome to the drink bar. My wonderfully delicious concoctions are sure to put a smile on your face. Why not order one and take a load off? Even better, you should invite a cute date to join. They're sure to love these. You're right, that does sound nice. Now to figure out who to invite. Ah, so we've only got the four this time. 
Okay, very well, very well. But we'll leave that be for now. Because that'll be a separate video like we did with the Class 7 one. So who are you guys? Just guests. I know, and just look at it. It's so cute and charming. I can't get enough of the texture of these black lumps either. This stuff is seriously addictive. Wow, this drink is so yummy. Oh. I expected more after the previous one. Hello, male guest. I came here to take a break and get away from it all for a little while. I made the right call. There's nothing better than lounging on the beach surrounded by me she's. What more could you want? Can you talk there? So, this is where you two got off to. Yes, it was getting a little hot, so we came to cool off in the shade and have a little chat. I should have expected Lakeside Beach to be this hot during the summer. I had better put on more sunscreen before getting up again. Ah, I forgot mine back in the changing room. That's okay, I'll let you borrow mine. I mean, the changing room is not that far, but okay. It's also gentle on the skin, so you don't have to worry about any negative effects. I'll take you up on that. Thank you, Ellie. Oh, you're not going to be able to reach your back, are you? Hold on, I'll help you. Thank you for that, too. You're a lifesaver. Man, that reminds me of the time I helped put sunscreen on Ellie, Cecile, and Risha a few years ago. Still lucky the goddess didn't strike me down for that one. Um, Lloyd? What were you thinking just now? Nothing. I'll uh, just be going now. Oh, Lloyd, you're so obvious. I'd be lying if I said I'd... It didn't cross my mind, too. I still get flushed just thinking about that. I don't know what has these two so flustered, but it must have been something significant. I'm going to help Altina put her sunscreen on, so could you give us some privacy, Lloyd? Wow, your hair is so beautiful. You're like brushing it while I'm back here. Really? Actually, I'm quite fond of how luscious and long your hair is, Ellie. I'm curious as to how you would treat mine, and I'd love to show you. Thank you. I really appreciate it. These two have really hit it off. Guess they do have their hair in common. They almost look like sisters from a distance. Nope, I'm not seeing it. Ellie is so considerate and mature. You can tell that she's grown up. I haven't had many chances to talk with her before, but I hope today will be different. Right, so who we got here over at the watermelon splitting? Don't normally see these four together, do you? Hmm. Splitting some watermelons, huh? You know it. Ash decided to run his mouth and make it a competition, so here we are. The rest of us figured we should join in just for the fun. No, oh, it's going to be fun, all right. Orlando got way too many over on me during our sold out training days. Now's my chance to settle the score. You better come at me with all you've got, old timer. I'm not going to lose to a simple game to you. You always were a gutsy punk. I like that about you. But you got another thing coming. I have a feeling we're definitely going to need a referee to help settle this. Hold on, what? Say no more. I'm not terribly familiar with the games of man. But I shall oversee your competition nonetheless. There will be no foul play under my careful watch. you got to be kidding me. At least they're all having a good time, even Zeit's getting into it. Man, Ash and Reen haven't changed one bit. So what about you, Lloyd? I'm just seeing in, in the distance, over there. <laughs> Kia and Tia with Mishy. Uh, so what about you, Lloyd? Enjoying your little vacay? Your holly bob? Now's your chance to make a move on one of the ladies. Sweep them off their feet, partner. I'm going to pretend I didn't just hear that. But uh, yeah, I'm having a good time. Dear, oh dear. I was just thanking Zayt for all the help he's given us. Roselia and the Hexen clan have also been watching over us from the shadows again. I don't even know where to begin. I know what you mean. Zayt here has had our backs for years. I don't know what we'd do without him. Hm. I'm not accustomed to so much sincerity, but I shall accept your gratitude all the same. But did you not come here to relax? You're both far too young to be getting so sentimental. Forget the difficulties of life and go and enjoy your youth. Hard to argue with words of wisdom when they come from you, Zai. He's right. Let's go have some fun today. 
I'm assuming if we speak to Reen, it'll be the same. It's not exactly every day that we can all get together to relax and unwind. All the more reason for us to make the most of what little downtime we have so that everyone leaves here happy and satisfied. Okay, so what happens if we do speak to Zeit then? Huh, there we go. I know I've long been labelled as a police dog, but even now, this is a rather strange sensation. I will not protest it. This must be akin to what Roselia feels having lived so many centuries surrounded by humans. Tch, guess I got no choice but to go with a full frontal attack. Hey, none for nothing, but doesn't get hot for you with all that long fur. What? It's certainly not cool, but I'm... Holy Beast sent by Adios. Something so trivial would never stand in the way of me and my duty. Also, I must say, you're surprisingly used to handling canines. Eh, it's nothing special. I just had this old mutt in my neighborhood growing up that would never shut up. Anyway, let me know if the heat starts getting to you. Right by the water, and I wouldn't mind taking a dip. Hm, I appreciate your concern. Well, let's get this party started. You're welcome to join if you want, Bannings. Always room for one more. Just don't come crying to me when you whiff it and end up eating sand instead of melon. <laughs> Alright, anyway, Mechamishi. It's two for the price of one. Take two swings at breaking open the watermelon for a single ticket. You can even invite a partner to aid you. What do you say? Will you give it a try? So this is that watermelon splitting game. That could be fun with one of the guys. Close bracket. Oh, just the two of them. Okay. Let's actually do one of these now. You got it, Lloyd. See it with Lloyd, your mind's eye. To the left. Oh. Right, right, right. Go, go, go. I got that one perfect. Focus. Do it. Yeah. It's split. Smash it open. Kill it. Easy does it. To the left, the right. Focus. Focus. See it with your mind's eye. Good luck. We're getting there. Oh, oh so close. Yeah. Hold it off. Mm. It went all right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's fine. Alright, so that one's done. Alright, here we go. Hi, Lloyd! Are you here to ride the banana boat? It's super fun. Plus, Tio's been crazy hyped up all day. <laughs> of course I'm excited. Behold, gaze upon Mish's unique coat of fur. It has perfect water resistance and passive cooling that can withstand the raging heat of the sun. He even has high-spec pole pads that allow him to skillfully control the boat. I can see it now. The endless trials that occurred to make this vision of perfection a reality. I feel so grateful to have basked in the glory of these unique Mishis. If this is not a miracle, then what is? Yeah, uh, that's definitely hyped up even by Tio's usual Mishi standards. Wow, these mascots are really awesome, huh? Me, it's kind of embarrassing how much you know about us. But we're not mascots, we're real genuine Mishis in the fur. All right, sorry, I knew that. This is what makes them so special. What a special opportunity we've been given. I could do this all day. Yeah, let's ride the banana boat some more. We'll play together later, okay, Lloyd? It's a promise. It's a dream come true to spend a day with everyone on the beach while surrounded by the entire Mishi bloodline. I don't know if I've ever been happier in my entire life. I feel as if I could float to the goddess's side at any moment. Take me away, Hadios! Easy now, Tio. Don't hurry to her just yet. Pretty sure we could still use your help down here. Oh dear. I'm so glad Zite was able to join us again. I can't wait to play with him some more. I wonder if he can ride in the banana boat. Something tells me he wouldn't be a fan of it, even if he could. But best not to burst her bubble. Right. Me? Why not take a partner with you onto the water for a fun banana boat ride? 
But be warned, the waves out there can be pretty nasty. You'll have to hang on tight to avoid falling off. So what do you say? A banana boat ride, huh? I need a partner. Who should I invite? Um, gotta go with Tio. It's Mishy. Alright, we'll go with course A. Beginner. Definitely beginner. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on tight! Roger that! Let's go! Avoid that. Just go this slow, Mishy, that's fine. Just just stay at this speed, that's all good. I'm fine with that, mate, I'm fine with that. Don't you worry about it. Careful, Lloyd! It's fine! Can I live it? <laughs> Where are you turning? Me. Good. <laughs> I love this. Yeah, I noticed. Good, good. There we go. <laughs> that was awesome! You really were in perfect sync! We did it, everyone! Return to the beach. Okay. Hey, Yuna. So you're teaming up with Noel? Hi, Lloyd. Yeah. We do get along pretty well, so I think we'd make for a good team. Our opponents aren't exactly going to be easy, though. Tell me about it. Wazzy and Musee are both the... heady types. We'll need to be careful, or else we'll play right into their hands without realizing it. We can't let that happen, Yuna. Let's stick to what we're best at and bring the fight to them. We'll break through their defenses with our own attack. I'm right behind you, Noel. Let's go all out. I'm looking forward to seeing how this match goes. Remember when we played beach volleyball together the first time we came here? You should join us later when you have time. It'll be fun. Being in the tennis club gives my shoulder muscles a good workout. You'd better look out for my spikes. Noelle and I are gonna dominate. Come on. Hey Lloyd. Here to play some beach volleyball? We were just about to start a game, so why don't you join us? I appreciate the invite, but there are still a few places I want to visit around the beach first. Gotta say though, not surprised you two formed a team. I got the impression you would get along. I guess you could say we have a thing or two in common. Like for example, having men in our lives who like to play hard to get. My struggles with the instructor are well documented at this point. Who do you have feelings for, Wazzy? Someone who still won't look at me the same way even now. Isn't it so unfair, Lloyd? How tragic. I sympathize with your plight. Okay, yeah, you two really are the same. Yeah. It's time we got that match started. Noelle and Yuna, huh? That's quite a formidable pair. This should be fun. Wazzy is quite the enigmatic fellow, isn't he? So mysterious. Then there's Noelle and her impressive strength. I'd like to see what she can do. Though I'll never look past Yuna's real go-getter attitude. It's simply too much fun getting reactions out of her. This girl. There's something about her that makes my detective's fight or flight instinct kick in. Indeed. Indeed. Right, so... What I think we'll do then... Is actually... I'll, I'll go to the next part now, which will be obviously the drinks bar, you know, separate video for that because there'll be separate scenes for that. But the bit after that where, you know, the end of the day comes around and there'll probably be a scene because we'll be finishing up all that type of stuff. We'll jump to that in this part rather than it being its own small part. It just makes sense that way. So be right back in a second after I've done the next part, you know. Something strange I noticed while I was getting ready for everything here. It says in the top left, Reen's route. There's only Lloyd on screen right now. Okay. 
Looks like everyone is having fun. It's been ages since we've been able to unwind and enjoy ourselves like this. Then maybe now is a good time to slip into the changing room for a break. Returning to the changing room will cause the daydream to advance and you will be unable to play on the beach any further. I don't have any tickets left, so... Yeah, that sounds good. Taking a short rest never hurt anyone. Hey Lloyd! Oh, what's up dear? You were just about to head inside, right? Can I come with you? I could use a break too. Yeah, of course. What do you say we get some ice cream while we're in there? Okay. You know, I'm really glad we were able to come here and have fun together like this. I know there's still plenty more to do before today's over. But I want you to promise we'll come back and do it all over again sometime. You bet. I promise this won't be the last time we get to do this. And next time we'll make sure that Cecile, Ilya, Sully and Fran can join us again. You should ask Arios, Shizuku, the Chief, and Mirei to come along too. The more the merrier, right? It'd be even more fun than today was. Yeah, I can't wait to do it again. Dum. Du -du 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 -dum. Any items obtained during this daydream will be added to your inventory for use in the real world and the Reverie Corridor. Mira! Oh. Saran powder. We'll probably sell that. Right, so there we go then. That's another daydream done for us. And we'll Sporting Stone activated. end this part here. And in the next part, we'll do what we were meant to be doing, which was... We should be able to fish here. No, not fishing. We'll be heading over here and doing some daydreams here. Which ones do we have? So I'm wondering which one we should start with next. Rendering browsing interface. We've got four to get through. Should we just make our way down the list? I mean, I really want to see that one. But, yeah, we'll, we'll just see about making our way down the list. Ta-da for now.